Hey guys, it's just me, Jeremy, uh, laying in bed on a Thursday night, uh, not really doing a whole lot, uh, just wanted to give you guys a little bit of a, of a vlog, uh, talk about some things, and, uh, let me first off tell you that I'm laying flat for a specific reason, and the specific reason is that I did a little bit of damage to myself last night. Uh, let me explain what happened. Uh, I was, I, I went to Channel 12, or I went to, uh, Bengals Nation, which is a TV show taped by the local CBS station, WKRC, uh, every Wednesday night during the football season. I went to this taping, you know, just to have fun, get my mind off of things. And, for the most part, I succeeded in that. I did that. Um, I had fun, I got to eat. Got to eat decently, uh, and, uh, you know, got to hang out with people that I only see during the football season, which was cool. And then it all went to hell on the trip home, because what happened was that the camera assembly, which is an assembly basically that fits in the wheel, and it uh, allows you to adjust the angle at which the, the wheel uh, sits on the wheelchair. Well, that assembly on the left side actually slid out on the way home last night. And the result of that was that I took a tumble hard to the concrete on Main Street in downtown Florence. Yeah. Not fun. In fact, it hurt. Uh, I'm still a little sore today, uh, which is why I'm currently laying flat. Um, it didn't help my neck, and that's the next subject, but, uh, I, you know, well, it, it didn't hurt my neck, but it didn't help anything either. So there was that. Um, and so that explains why I'm laying flat, or at least somewhat flat. Anyway, uh, so there's that. Um, the next subject is, well, uh, what am I, uh, the next subject is, uh, what's going on with my neck? What am I dealing with? Well, um, I had my neurosurgeon appointment last week, and the neurosurgeon basically said that, um, yeah, it looks like I'm gonna have to have surgery. Um, which I pretty much already suspected was going to be the case, um, based on talking to my doctor, my regular doctor. Well, uh, in talking to him, he decided to order a couple more tests. Those tests included an, a, uh, a neck x-ray, a neck CAT scan, and an MRI on my brain. And the latter two haven't happened yet. Those happen September 17th, and I'll keep you apprised of what I find out with those. Um, the x-ray I did have before I left the doctor's office um, last week, and the results came back on that. And basically, uh, your neck actually is supposed to have a curve in it um, that points, and the curve actually points toward your neck. I don't have that curve anymore. I lost that curve. Um, I don't know when I lost that curve. I just know I lost it. And I don't have it anymore. And so, um, it's going to be something that they have to deal with. Uh, when it gets dealt with, probably in October. Um, after I go in have the other two tests, the other two tests, and then meet with my neurosurgeon again. And I see him again on the 23rd of September at 10.30 in the morning. And by September 24th, I'll know exactly when I'm going in for surgery. Um, but, uh, yeah, so that's going to be happening um, pretty quick. Um... I don't know, uh, I do know that 
I'm facing some pretty serious surgery. Um, it's going to be something that takes a few hours to do, and then they're going to keep me in the hospital overnight for observation. But, the good news, if there is good news, is that at least for now, I can pretty safely say I will not have surgery before the annual Spina Bifida Coalition of Cincinnati Walk and Roll uh, that I'm scheduled to do. Uh, I am scheduled to uh, take part in that, and as of right now, it looks like that's going to happen. Um... I'm going to I'm going to tell you right now I am going to limit my uh, my work uh, I can I can still participate but I'm going to limit myself and so I'm gonna need some help uh, and so I know that I got people ready to help me and I appreciate that uh, shout out to my black and blue grass uh, roller girl friends out there I know y'all uh, are supporters of mine Every year, it's much appreciated. Love y'all. Much respect uh, to the BBRG. So, um, so I will be at the walk. Um, I'm pretty sure at this point. Uh, the only reason I would not be at the walk is that he gets or he sees me on the 23rd, and then on the 25th they turn around and decide to operate, and then I spend two days in the hospital. Which is unlikely. Uh, very, very unlikely to happen. Um, so, um, so there's that. Oh, speaking of the walk and roll, I'm going to put a link in the description of this video. Uh -huh. And uh, I need donations. And I'm trying to reach a goal of $500. I don't know if I'm going to. I hope I do. But if you could help me out, I'd appreciate it. Uh, so I'll put a link in the description of the video down below. Um, or is it this way? Is it this way? I don't know. It's It'll be under underneath the video. Uh, uh, for the, both the team and for myself. Uh, you can only donate to individuals, but it all goes toward the team goal. So with that in mind, final topic. Football. Uh, football season starting up. Uh, there's a uh, regular season game tonight as I record this. Who you got? Uh, who's your team? Uh, are you a Patriots fan, like I know a couple of my friends are? Are you a Steelers fan, like I know a couple people are? Are you a Bengals fan, like I am, and like my mom is? Are you a Texans fan, a Dolphins fan, a Raiders fan, a 49ers fan, Seahawks, Broncos? Who you got? Who's your team? Uh, let me know in the comments uh, underneath this video. And, uh, yeah. So, that's going to end it for what I'm going to call the Lang Flat Vlog. Uh, I'm Jeremy Moses. Thank you for watching. Thank you for listening. I hope to see you right back here in the very near future. Uh, take care, everybody. And uh, go Bengals, in my case. Or go whichever team you support. <laughs> take care, everybody.